How many types of concrete batching plants are there? There are many classification standards for concrete plants. Concrete plant can be divided into the stationary concrete plant and mobile concrete plant depending on whether can be movable. It can be also divided into dry mix plants and wet mixing plants depending on whether a central mixer is used. Stationary Concrete Plant The stationary concrete plant is designed to produce high-quality concrete. It has the advantages of large output, high efficiency, high stability, and high specification. Stationary concrete batching plant adopts reliable and flexible, it is easy to maintain and own a low failure rate. It is widely used in various projects such as roads and bridges, ports, tunnels, dams, and buildings. Mobile Concrete Plant The mobile batch plant, also known as a portable concrete plant is a very productive, reliable, and cost-effective piece of equipment to produce batches of concrete. It allows the user to batch concrete at most any location then move to another location and batch concrete. Portable plants are the best choice for temporary site projects or even stationary locations where the equipment height is a factor or the required production rate is lower. Dry Mix Concrete Plant A dry mix concrete plant, also known as transit mix plant, weighs sand, gravel, and cement in weight batchers via digital or manual scales. All the ingredients then are discharged into a chute which discharges into a truck. Meanwhile, water is either being weighed or volumetrically metered and discharged through the same charging chute into the mixer truck. These ingredients are then mixed for a minimum of 70 to 100 revolutions during transportation to the job site. Wet Mix Concrete Plant In a wet mix concrete plant, the concrete is mixed at a single point and then simply agitated on the way to the job site. To prevent setting, using agitators or ready mix trucks, or hauled to the job site in an open body dump truck. Dry mix differs from wet mix plants in that wet mix contains a central mixer whereas dry, which can offer a more consistent mixture in a shorter time, generally 5 minutes or less. If want to know more, please visit click to view other videos.